Hi everyone and welcome back to my channel. Before I'm going to get into all the rambling and showing you all the things, I want, I really want to advise you to go and grab a drink, a snack or something, as I can feel this is going to be a very, very long one. I know it's been a long time since we last seen each other. I've put a couple of videos while I was away. If you follow me on social media, you know I've been away to Romania for the entire month of April. My birthday was on 11th of April. I want to thank you all so much for your kind wishes, your private messages, all ev just everything. <laughs> thank you ever so much to Sophie. Sophie Goodwin here on, um, on YouTube. I'm gonna leave her channel down below. I didn't expect when I came back from Romania, I had a birthday package from her and I'll show you all the bits she sent me. I genuinely have no words to express how thankful I, I am for that. Literally, she left me speechless, I didn't expect that. She told me she's gonna send me a card, but she just went all, you know, beyond with everything. By the way, if you hear some sound, it's raining really heavily right now, so just so you know if you hear a lot of sound. And yeah, uh, what else? Um, I've been in April for the entire month. Uh, it was the first birthday I spent with my family in years and years and years and with my family and friends. Uh, I had some amazing surprises from them, amazing flowers, gifts, but above all of them I just had them there with me so that just overrules everything. I want you to know that I'm very, very thankful for everything I have here. Majority of the gifts, I'm not going to lie, they're from my boyfriend. I've been given a lot of money so a lot of the items were purchased by myself. But yeah, let's get into it, because I'm rambling a lot, and if I remember things as we go through, I'm going to tell you. My actual birthday, I celebrated with family and friends at my grandparents' house. My dad was kind enough to supply an amazing dinner for all of us, and drinks and everything, and he also gave me 31 roses, a giant, giant bouquet of roses that I was really, really thankful for. Right, so I'm going to start straight with items, and I'm going to put this. You probably can't see anything, but I'm just going to give it a glimpse of it. There are a lot of pictures. Look at that. That's that's me when I was a kid. And a lot of pictures with my family and stuff. And this was gifted by my auntie just before I left. It actually didn't arrive in time for my birthday, but she, she gave it to me literally the night before I left. And obviously it brought tears in my eyes because there are pictures of my family and my mum. And you already know. Another thing, is I'm going to try and have an order with the gifts. I received this from my friend Sarah, and these are pictures from last year from my birthday. If you remember, I celebrated my 29th birthday with all work colleagues in London, and she made me a beautiful collage and also gave me this beautiful, beautiful heart that says, friends are stars that make your life sparkle. I can already feel I'm going to get emotional through this video. Also, another load of friends that were used to be work friends. We gathered for a meal when I came back, and they gave me this amazing candle. This is be your own kind of beautiful and you know how much I love this quote if you've been following me for a while. And also they arranged a spa day. So at the end of this month I'm going to go with them and have a spa day and I have like some free stuff included. So thank you ever so much for that. I'm going to show you, that's like about memorabilia. I have a lot of cars there behind me. I'm going to take them down today because it's May and my birthday's long gone, but I will keep them forever and ever. I also received some jewellery and they're all Pandora. They're all in one box. I'm just going to show them quickly. I received this from my auntie as well and it's the Pandora um, heart ring. And you know what? I'm just going to put it on my finger now because I, I love it and I just couldn't wait to get it out. I also received this ring from my boyfriend and I really love it because it has free flowers so it reminds me of my 30s. By the way guys, that's another thing if you guys don't know by now or you didn't see in my little you know, screen capture at the beginning of the video, I turned 30 this year. And yes, I know it's a really big number and really scary but in, you know, in the same time my mind is still a let's say 16 just so I'm very nice today. <laughs> I want to say free, you know. I received this from my grandma. It's, in, it's a little charm from Pandora and it's a little cake that says happy birthday. And from my granddad, I received these earrings also from Pandora. They go with the ring that I received from my boyfriend. I also have the single flower ring. By the way, I didn't forget about my Pandora collection. I did film it in the past, but it turned out completely wrong and I had to delete the footage, but I will be refilming it. So I did not forget about that, but you will see these ones included as well. Uh, let me show you some clothes and things. 
Right, I'm gonna start with some underwear. I have some underwear from Victoria's Secret. These are from my boyfriend as well. They're all the same model, so I'm just gonna show you one pair sort of thing because the other ones are just different patterns. I love underwear from Victoria's Secret. I won't be lying, it is quite pricey, but yeah. So this is the style of underwear, and I love them to bits. The fabric is so soft, I would rub it all over my face now, but I can't because I have a lot of makeup on. I also received more pants, so that was a set of three, and I also received some more, and I'll be showing you these ones very quickly. You're gonna see me throwing things everywhere. So I have them in this color, a very, very nice purple, and a lovely, lovely pink that actually says after party here. I love these two bits, and I can't wait to finally wear them because I kept them all for this haul. Um, let me show you some clothes. Uh, I received this top again from my boyfriend. He says New York and I believe he's from uh, Yeah, H&M. I received this uh, Shirt as well. It has a really really nice print with little birds and I can't wait to wear this one as well I received this t-shirt from my best friend Eliza and I love the quote in it It says don't collect things just moments and that's just so so true guys like all these things I know I'm gonna show you a lot of things they're very expensive probably a lot of them and you'll be wondering like oh yeah just you're just so lucky you received all these presents but for me the luckiest thing this year was actually to celebrate with people I love and you know family and friends and that's the most important don't forget if you have those people around you it doesn't matter what gifts I had years when I had zero gifts so maybe another time I'll be talking about that but yeah I'll be getting back into the haul now I received this from my auntie as well in the first glimpse, I was like, oh, what is this? I don't know if I'll ever wear it. But you know what? I can style this with some jeans and some really nice stilettos and like a nice clutch back. And I can see this vest top actually working for a lot of different situations and occasions. Um, I'm sorry, I keep turning here. I have this from Victoria's Secret as well. And oh my God, I can't wait to put it on my phone. It has makeup and everything I love on it. And it's for the iPhone 6. And I'm just going to show you this pile here. It's a pile of things that weren't presents, but I just purchased while I was there. But there are not too many things, so I thought I'll show them quickly in this. I got Nivea Intimate Gel. I've been told it's really, really good. I got a Beauty Look Stainless Steel Level uh, Scissors. I got the Vichy Dercos, and I heard, by the way, I had really bad scalp issues. When I went to Romania with this and the water there, it just disappeared. So if you guys have issues, try this. It's really good. Um, I bought two Missler waters from Avene, and I have to say, I think I still like the Bioderma one more, but nevertheless, I like it. I have the other one already used in, in the bathroom. I opened it while I was in Romania. I got some stickers from Jumbo. A little comb. Moss stickers from Jumbo and I got a glamour magazine in the airport and I wanted to share this with you just because it's still on the market at the moment It comes with an essence lip gloss and I'll be showing you I put it with the cosmetics I forgot to put it separately and it also comes with some coffee and I found that very very interesting It actually actually comes with some coffee and everything. So yeah um, Just to finish what I have on top here. I actually received Flutur by Irina Binder uh, there are two volumes. It calls, it's called Butterfly. It's a um, it's a book about life and feelings and like it's a book about her. As far as I know, I haven't started reading it just because I kept them away with the pile, but I can't wait to get into this. Uh, I've read a few passages from it, and I think a lot of people don't like this and said it's a silly book and whatsoever. But when I read a bit out of it, I feel like I wrote it. So for me, those books are meant to be read. Also, if you hear anything in the background, is my dog that is around here. I'm home alone while filming this, so I can't send him anywhere else. Received some black ripped jeans from my best friend as well. By the way, about the clothes, maybe I'm going to do some Instagram um, pictures and style them and stuff. I also received these uh, jeans. I'm going to try and show them like this. They're very, very ripped and very like boyfriendy baggy jeans, but I love them two bits. They to go away. My dog is literally just here and I don't want him to go over my lights and stuff because he'd done that before. Right. Have I showed you everything around me? Well, I showed you like clothes and jewelry. I'm sorry, but I can see my hair is like my hair. By the way, guys, if you have any 
suggestions when your hair gets what's it called static i'm getting really really bad static i tried cold you know cold of not putting products in it and using cold water the last rinse not like doing that with a towel it's just really really like if i do this i don't know if you can see like literally my hair just goes poof and it's static really bad so i'm like very conscious of like keep dropping it down but i think i'm making it worse right and i'm out of breath now I'm gonna get into the makeup bits now. I'm not gonna have a certain things. I'm gonna try and tell you who gave them to me and stuff, but yeah. Right, I received this from MUA and it's a Makeup um, Academy Mosaic Blush in English Rose Shade Free. This was from Sophie. As I said, I'm gonna put her channel down below. She's a really, really lovely girl. She just had baby Theo. She just gave birth to baby Theo and I'm really, really excited for her. So Sophie, if you're watching, congratulations, lovely. I, I just wish you all the best. Um, she gave me this and oh my God, I just don't wanna even swatch it because it's so beautiful. I never had anything like this before and I'm looking forward to test this out. She also gave me the collection Ice Undercover Nude Rose Palette. And again, some very, very lovely shades here. I didn't even see this palette before, nor I swatched it. I will probably try and swatch some of these things on my Instagram account because, you know what, let's just swatch one just to see the pigmentation in it. What colour should we do? Let's do the darkest one. I don't think that was a good idea because now I'm going to have black on my... Um on my hands oh my god the pigmentation is really really good guys i don't think you can see anything but yeah that's the black shadow with and it has like you know in the naked palette they have the uh glitter in it like the red glitter this one has a red glitter in it and it's really beautiful from sephora when i went and purchased some items i said i had money from my boyfriend to purchase things while i was in romania and they gave me a little happy birthday blush and I didn't expect that, to be honest. I was like, oh, they were like, happy birthday. And they gave me a little blush. And I won't be lying. Last time I've done this, I ruined my nail. And also my hand went straight into it. But he also says, happy birthday on the blush. And he has a peach and a pink shade. And I can't wait to test this one as well. Some of these items I actually tested, guys. Because, as I said, I was in Romania for like a month. So some of them I already... Uh, you know tested them and stuff but i'll let you know as i go through them i have the Too faced candlelight and probably you can see a lot of glare in the packaging there and oh my god isn't this like divine it looks so beautiful again it's untested i only tested it in the shop and it looks so beautiful okay let's put our hands on it i should have grabbed a i didn't think i'm gonna do swatches but Oh my god, I don't know if you guys can see that, but it's beautiful. Like it has like the pink one has an iridescence to it. I I think you can really see this one. It's beautiful, beautiful. Um Mac. I purchased a few items in the airport uh from Mac and oh my god, I love that because they have 20% off and as you know, Mac never ever have a sale on, so was I excited about that and I purchased this and it was in the new collection and it's called uh, Sunny Surprise and oh my god this is such a beautiful beautiful blush I don't know how much it's gonna show it's a very nice um, I would say it's like you think it's a very baby pink but it's actually a peach color and it's very very beautiful Another item I received, and these, the last ones were all from my boyfriend, is from Givenchy, and is their Poudre Lumière Originale. Again, I am going, you people, if you're French, you're going to laugh at me at wet, uh, a lot. It's basically an illuminating powder, but I used it. I actually used it, guys, as a uh, to set my concealer, and it looks really, really beautiful. Um, right. This is how it looks. You can see I probably you can probably see I used it already, and it's a really really beautiful power uh, powder. Uh, you, I won't swatch it here because you probably won't see it, but trust me when I tell you that it's a really really beautiful powder. Amazing consistency. If you see it in Sephora or wherever shops you have, I bought mine from Sephora. You have to go and give it a swatch. Uh, I also received. 
this is all due to Tati. I'm sure you already all know who Tati is. I seen a review on this product and I was like, oh my birthday, I want to buy that. It's the Guerlain Law. It's the gold pro face primer from Guerlain and oh my god, isn't it beautiful? Looks like this and as you can see, I already used quite a bit of it because I quite like it. I don't know if it tightens my face just as Tati was saying that she feels her face like really tighten up and everything but nevertheless it's a great primer very expensive is around 46 pounds so i don't know how many times i'm going to repurchase it or you know if i'm going to keep um how is it called if i'm going to you know keep using it on an everyday basis because it's quite expensive to use like that i also bought the dior skin nude air flash no not flash sorry it's just your skin nude air and it's in 010 is their lighter shade and it's that pipette foundation and it looks like this and I really like it so far I have to use it a lot more to give you an impression but so far I like it I bought a Romanian item as well from Gero Vital and it looks like this and it's a CC cream and I have to say it's in light by the way now I have to say I really like this it smells of like raspberries that's really really nice it has a really nice texture really nice finish um, I would say it has a medium light to medium coverage but really nice and I like the colour, it's not orange whatsoever and that's very rare usually in this, this type of products. A lot of CC creams I've found, I like a lot from Nivea but a lot of times they can go very orange on me. I bought some brushes as well and I got this new Sephora brush and let me just open it quickly to show it to you because it's beautiful, beautiful. Is there um, number 83? Is there a new foundation brush? And it looks like this and they say it's for liquid foundation only and I'm looking forward to test this. Very interesting, very interesting shape. The girl there recommended it, you know, she couldn't recommend it enough basically so I decided to buy it. But on the same note, I came back to England and uh, my um, boyfriend's mum gave me again some money. So I went to Boots to make some purchases. And one of the items I purchased was these, this, sorry. And it was the Clinique brush. Uh, when I came back, I've seen some videos and I've seen this in Essie's Buttons video and a couple more videos. So I decided to purchase it. It's the Clinique foundation brush and everyone says it's divine. It's really, really soft. It's a dual fiber brush and I can't wait to finally test it because I was dying to test this one and I haven't used it. Also from my boyfriend's mum, I got this Bumble and Bumble... Um, Semi Sumo High Shine Low Hold Pomade. I'm wearing it today, but it's not really helping me tame this frizz and static. But yeah, it, I like it nevertheless. I like it. I wore it on different days and I really liked it. Um, this was a gift with purchase from Sephora in Romania. When I bought the Givenchy item, they gave me this. And inside of it, let me just try. As I said, there's so many items in here that I'm just trying... Uh, it's in the other one. Inside it had a little mascara that I'm going to share with you in a second. I also got a new beauty blender because you can not can never have enough beauty blenders. I had this lovely necklace from uh, Sophie as well in a package. From my boyfriend's mum I also had this little card holder and it's from New Look. And he says I just want to buy pretty things. And that's me all over. I have a really beautiful uh, wallet. That I received a Christmas from my boyfriend from Vivian Westwood and I adore that. But you know, when, when you go with a very small bag or a night out or things like that, I just want my card and a bit of cash and that will be very, very handy. Uh, <laughs> i just seen this. This is a um, little key ring from Rome that my friends brought me from Rome because they've been Rome and when I went home they actually gave me a little, um, you know, treat from there, if you can say it like that. Oh, another thing that you're going to uh, laugh at me, I bought this and it's a uh, wild tiger balm and it's a, um, as far as I know it's a Chinese item and I already used a bit of it, it's good for like muscles and things like that, you know, put it when you have a headache and all sorts of things. Uh, also from Sophie I have this beautiful mirror and by the way I have this beautiful, beautiful a uh, makeup bag that looks like Ted Baker one and I put all my things in it that I'm going to show you now I had loads of samples as well all sorts of samples from Sephora and Douglas because I shopped in there for my present 
all sorts of samples literally i couldn't show you they gave me so many they're so nice in there oh i also bought this i bought the 168 from mac i had a, a ebay dupe that i used even in my if you watch my last um you know the contour kit from tyler blue the review i was using the fake brush from them i gave that brush to my best friend and purchased the real one I have more samples oh another item that for me it's a must is the origin spot remover mine was empty and you're probably going to see it in a future empties and i really really like this it it genuinely helps with your spots just dries them up and it's really really good i have a nail polish from gabrini it's a romanian you find it in romania usually it's a flat brush nail polish and it's a glitter it's a very very beautiful glitter and i would recommend actually this one it holds really nice on the nail this is a little mascara sample I received from Zivanshi and isn't it beautiful? I can't wait to test it out. Guys, I have so many items. Clinique also gave me, when I bought the brush, they gave me a little mascara. Um, Sophie sent me some eyelashes from Revlon in uh, Intensify Oxyfiber Volumized Technology. So I'm looking forward to test that as well. Oh, from my boyfriend, I received something that I really, really wanted. And they're the Meat Matte Hughes uh, lip glosses. Uh, not lip glosses, liquid matte lipsticks in Committed and Charming. And I have to swatch these for you guys because I just have to. They're so good. I'm going to probably ruin my nails opening this packaging. This is how it looks and this is Charming. And they're so beautiful. But in the same time, guys, I have to tell you, they are so, so drying like so dry this is the very bad space to do swatches i'm going to do it on the back of my hand so drying they are like they're beautiful but your lips like you have to reapply for the day because if you just keep it on your lips will crack so this is charming no i'm sorry i almost swore this is committed and this is charming the darker one so committed is a orangey like nude orange tone and um charming is again a very similar tone but a bit darker with a bit of like red and brown undertone i would say if you see the balm anywhere go and check them out they're really really beautiful so these are the shades and i'm going to show them to you as well when they dry out um Another item, well, two items I grabbed from a Romanian brand are from Golden Rose and I grabbed two eyeshadows. Uh, they're the Silky Touch Pearl eyeshadows and this is in 115. And they reminded me of a MAC one, so I really, really wanted to test it out. Let's do it a little swatch. Ah. Uh. When I tested these, oh, by the way, I forgot to tell you, when I went to Romania, I had a little meet-up with a few of you, and I met Merve, who I say, hello, you know, we grabbed these together, and also Dorina and Cristina from another side of me, I'm going to leave their YouTube channel down below as well. It was so amazing to meet them, I felt so like myself there with them, because every time I go out, no one understands really my passion for makeup, so to be there with someone that loves makeup just as much as you do is just an amazing experience, so thank you ever so much girls for coming to meet me and it was amazing i hope to see you again very soon and also one in 116 a very similar shade but slightly slightly well darker but same sort of family well not really the first one is more orangey the second one is pinky but they looked very similar when i was just holding them one by another but yeah very good eyeshadows and girls from romania go and check them out check their stands they usually have now stands in all the malls and things like that so check their eyeshadows because they're really pigmented Whew. grab three lip pencils from mac and guys i have to tell you something I only owe one MAC uh, lip liner and it, I would say it was very drying and so and so and I didn't understand the fuss. I went and bought these ones and these are all really creamy so I don't know if they changed the formula or what but they're really good so go and give them a try. Uh, and I got some really like, in the airport I was lucky enough to find shades that usually I don't find in Debenhams or anywhere else and I got Whirl, Spice and Bubbly Bear gorgeous gorgeous colors and i would really recommend them oh i grabbed a lancome juicy shaker and oh my god i was so excited to grab this and i grabbed again it was a, an item that was inspired by um essie button in vanilla pop she showed it in a favorites just before i left or while i was there and i i went and grabbed it 
And by the way, with this one, I really like it. Really nice consistency. Will really like give you a really nice um, moisturized feel to your lips because it's oil based. But you have to apply it really often. And the pigmentation in the item is quite low, but it's a good product. But keep in mind that it's not one of those that you'll put on and you'll have it for the day. You have to apply, I would say, every like two hours, even one hour sometimes. Um, I have another um, nail polish from Pharmacy. This was such a beautiful colour. I had my nails painted with it while I was in Romania. But I have to say, I do not recommend these nail polishes. It chipped on me on day one. So I don't recommend them. I'll try. I, I had a good top coat on and everything, so I don't know what's gone there. Sephora also gave me a mini lipstick as a sample. Oh, there's the thing. I was saying at the Glamour magazine, you have this Essence uh, lipstick and it's a matte lipstick. Well, they say a long lasting lip gloss, the matte. And it's in Coral Mousse. And I didn't try any of their lip products, to be honest. Any of Essence lip products. It's really hard to get the wand out. Okay, I got it out. Let's give it a swatch. Really nice colour. I'll be honest, it feels a bit patchy. But I don't know, I'll give it a try. But this one comes free with the magazine. Looks quite nice. And it's it's so funny. It's a light um, version of this. I don't know how it picks up on camera. But in reality, I think now it picks up a bit. It's more orangey. I'm looking forward to test this one out on my lips. As I never did. Also from Sophie. She was kind enough to show me some eyeshadow. She sent me an eyeshadow from Asta. And I know this brand because we used to have it in Romania when I was younger. And my mum used to buy it. And it's holiday time. It's really a holiday time colour to be honest. And a Max Factor Max Effect Mono Eyeshadow in Mysterious Black. Not many items left, I promise. Clinique also gave me one of their chubby sticks. I love this colour and it's in... Oh, what was the colour? Ooh, super Strawberry. I love this one. It's one of my go-to things when I have no makeup day. Just to give me a tint to my lips. I finally gave in and bought the MAC Velvet Teddy. I know you all probably seen swatches, but I just really want to swatch it again. Uh, I finally gave in into this color and purchased it. Is this one here, and it's beautiful. I'm I'm really happy I finally done it, and it looks really nice with all three of those lip liners I purchased. So yeah, look at all these beautiful lipsticks. Um, as I said, I received this as well from Sophie and from my cousin and his missus. I received this Clinique uh, lipstick. They actually gave me a uh, voucher in Douglas and I went to purchase this lipstick. Because this is, again, a YouTuber's fault, a Chanelette here on YouTube. And she gave, uh, she told me about this bare pop colour. And it just looked so, so good that I had to go and get it. Oh my god, it's beautiful. I have never even swatched it. Look at that. Such a gorgeous nude. I hope this is the colour she was talking about. But yeah, really beautiful. And the last item I have to share with you guys is I've been here from half an hour. And I'm really scared you guys won't even sit and watch this because it's so long. This is a present I made to myself now when I came back home. I didn't, all these items I said I purchased with someone else's money beside those few little items that I showed you at a point. And I got myself the Alice in Wonderland palette. I will be filming a separate video opening this, watching it, as I really want to share with you. Since you guys seen on Instagram that I purchased it, you asked me about the colours. So I'm going to be filming a video now for you guys and share it with you how, um, you know, how this is and stuff like that. Give you a little review and swatches. This is everything I received for my birthday. I also had a lot of flowers, as I said, and cards and everything, a lot of messages. I am extremely grateful for everything I had, but most important for the people I had in my life. Thank you all so, so much for all the gifts, all the wishes, for being there with me on my birthday or around my birthday, and just making my day more beautiful. Thank you ever so much for watching and putting up with me for half an hour. I hope you have an amazing, amazing day. And still, and still, until next time, please don't forget to stay beautiful inside and out. Bye, guys.